Hey, hey guys, welcome, welcome back to my channel. So this is Jocelyn bringing you another great opportunity, of course, to work from home. Now the name of the company is Guidewell, but they have an opportunity with a company called Florida Blue for a customer care specialist remote. Before we get into it, I just want to say to you all, happy Valentine's Day to all the romantics, the singles, happy Valentine's Day to all of you. I hope you have a lovely day. And if you're just not going out with anyone or, or anything like that, hey, still pamper yourself today, okay? Love on you. All right, so let's get right into it. So once again, the name of the company is Florida Blue. And it's for a customer care specialist remote position. It is full time, of course, and it is in the United States, just for you all to know. And the start date for this job is April 3rd this year. And the training duration hours are to June the 23rd this year. And it's Monday through Friday, 9.30 a.m. to 6 p.m. Eastern Standard. So if you're in a different time zone and they're hiring in your area, just go ahead and convert that time, okay? So the shift after trainings are they're going to be assigned in an eight-hour shift increment with scheduled breaks. So 8 a.m. to 6.30 p.m. Monday through Friday, EST once again. And you just need to be someone that's interested in the job and you qualify. So what they offer here is great benefits, health and dental visions, and then also um, 401k, 18 days of personal time off in the first year, and then 10 holidays and one floating holiday per year. They also have life insurance and disability benefits, pet insurance if you have a pet, um, work-life balance programs, and much more um, great benefits available for you guys to help you. All right. And so then also what you're going to be doing on this job is having a very important role in telephonically. And you're going to be serving, have to have that potential to be able to work in that area with new and existing customers. So you will tell telephonically <laughs> assist members in the following areas. OK, so you're going to review a member's account to help them manage health conditions, cost and facilitate access to health care providers and resources, things of that sort. You're going to initiate a caring experience for the member, which sets the standard for future interactions with customer service. So you're going to utilize the Florida Blue Call Strategy. That's what they call it. And you're going to be providing outstanding customer service and call resolutions. So you're going to learn this in training, of course. They have a strategy and they call it the Florida blue call strategy so that you'll be able to operate in great customer service to assist, all right, with follow-up issues and to ensure resolution for the customer, okay, and have a great resolve there. You're going to research and resolve service-related inquiries, meeting established expectations for quality, productivity, and timelines. You're going to assist members by questioning, probing, and reasoning. So you guys know about you know, probing and asking questions with the members when they call in, hello, thank you for calling, da 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 da, -da that's your script. And you go into there and you just find out how you can help. That's customer service. So easy peasy, right? So what must you have? You need to have two years of customer service experience or an equivalent, guys, a combination of education and experience. And then you need one year of building collaborative relationships with customers. So you need to know how to actually gain that rapport and work with customers and speak to them, clients or peers of, in different teams. And then you need a high school diploma or equivalent, which is a GED, of course. And then what you're going to be needing in order to operate with the company. You need high-speed internet with a router that has two ports. Guys, make sure you get... USB headsets and make sure you have Ethernet cord backups, okay? Because you need to be hardwired to your modem, okay? Use an Ethernet cord and that's the direct connect internet connection. So the ability to commit to a 12 week fully paid training program, okay, with limited absences. So those absences will only be um, based on if you have a real emergency, basically. So ability to use multiple systems while you resolve, respond to customer inquiries. So you need to be able to navigate different screens, basically, and concerns via phone. So you need to be able to talk on the phone. If you're someone that's shy, and you can't really hold a conversation without maybe, you know, tripping up on your words maybe i know we trip up sometimes but just saying like just a real conversation where you're confident then you might not want to do this job or you may want to do um you know practice a lot before you get into it okay because it may be something you want to do but you need to practice more with that so also using sound problem solving and decision making skills you're going to need that demonstrating empathy and compassion of course you always want to do that regardless if you work for this customer service job or not you always want to have compassion for people you just need to be a level person without standing listening and communication skills as well ability to work assigned shifts between 9 30 a.m to 6 p.m eastern standard once again convert that time right 
occasional nights and weekends, holidays may be necessary as business needs are required of you. All right. So then also being bilingual, guys, with this company is an added plus. So Spanish or Creole. All right. And then previous experience working with a health insurance company. So if you have that type of experience, hey, I recommend you to apply. So what's next for you with this job? So you will have a four-step selection process with this company, okay? So step one, application and resume review, of course, once you submit it and things of that sort. And then step two, video interview. And then step three, face-to-face video interview. And then step four, background investigation, which will include verifying two years of previous employment or education, okay? And then sedentary work, exerting up to 10 pounds of force occasionally to move objects. So that may be something that you may be doing. I'm not sure if they're going to have you like faxing something or something like that. But working from home, more than likely, you might not have to do that. That might be for more people who work in the office. I'm just kind of put the disclaimer there. So they are an equal opportunity employer, protected veteran, and disabled, okay? So all you need to do is click apply now for this job, of course. And you already know, guys, what to do. You get into it. You apply for Florida Blue if you're interested. Put your email address in here. Click continue. Here is the timeline. Email verification, resume, past current employment status, verify, demographics, demographics two, additional documents, summary, and submit. And voila, you're done. It looks like it's a pretty long timeline, but it's not that long, really. It's just really just going through the steps. So it's really short. And if you fill out applications before, you kind of know what you've done throughout the years. So, all right. If, especially if you have a steady background in work. So I'd like to thank you guys for tuning in. Like, share, and subscribe. And hey, share, 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 guys. Come on now. Support, support, support. And once again, to all of the lovers out there in the romantics, happy Valentine's Day. Ciao.